Welcome to the GE Video Academy. This video will demonstrate configuring the peer-to-peer -peer feature on SDX radios. When peer-to-peer -peer is enabled, remote radios in a network can pass data directly between each other through the AP. In order for the AP to understand the data it is receiving and retransmitting, the peer-to-peer -peer option must be enabled on the AP. To enable peer-to-peer -peer on an AP radio, open up a web browser to the AP radio and log in. Navigate using the toolbar on the left hand side of the web page to the configuration screen and then the feature screen. Scroll down to the peer to peer section. Change the rebroadcast allowed parameter to true for serial data retransmission. Select the proper filtering to apply to Ethernet retransmissions. When the desired choices have been configured, click on the Commit Configurations button. To enable peer to peer on the remote radios, that will pull directly to one another via the AP. Open up a web browser to each peer and log in. Navigate via the configuration and features on the navigation bar and then scroll down to the peer-to-peer -peer section. Set serial rebroadcast request to true for serial data polling or set ethernet rebroadcast request to true for ethernet data polling. If the remote radio is only polling serial or ethernet data, only one need be chosen. If the remote radio is polling both serial and ethernet data, then set both parameters to true. In this example, data is being polled from COM2 to COM2 of the remote peers. Data is also being polled from the AP radio's data port and being received by both remote radios or all remote radios in the network. It can be seen that data can be passed from the first remote to the second and vice versa without affecting communications between the AP and the remotes.